As well as learning languages himself, Alex has also taught intensive language courses. He also appears in the media and regularly attends events organized by institutions such as the European Council and the British Council to promote language learning and multilingualism. He has also written a book, How to Speak Any Language Fluently. Yeah, it's a good question. Um, so, put, so put it this way, I've never met anyone who couldn't learn a language. You know, I mean, if they had the right motivation, the right time allocation, uh, the right resources and the right expectations, I've never met anyone who's had all of those things in place and still failed. Um, but many of us fail to learn languages because one of those things is not there. We don't have enough time, we're not doing it for the right reasons, or we expect it to be a lot easier than it actually is. Well, um, the easiest language for me to learn was definitely Afrikaans because um, the grammar is very, very simple. So there are almost no irregular verbs. Uh, there's only three real tenses you have to worry about. And a lot of the vocabulary in Afrikaans is very similar to vocabulary in English. So for example, um, there's this sentence which is my pen is in my hand and my hand is in warm water, which in Afrikaans is my pen is in my hand and my hand is in warm water which, you know, is very, very easy for English speakers to learn. So um, the easiest languages to learn are the languages that are most similar to the one you speak natively, because you, you don't have to learn so many new concepts, and maybe you can already understand a lot of the vocabulary because it's similar to what you already know. Um, I think British and American people think that they're not very good at languages. I think um, we don't have much confidence um, because when we go abroad to other countries, we, um, we expect people to speak English, people expect us to speak English, so we never get a chance to practice the little bits of other languages that we might know. I think the, the most important thing for someone who wants to learn a new language to remember is that nothing happens overnight. Um, learning languages is a lifelong activity and you basically, you never finish. You never get to that finishing line where you think, right, what should I do next? Um, when you learn a new language, you need to um, accept the fact that there will always be more to learn, no matter how much you learn. And so the best approach is to just start doing it in little steps, just doing, say, 10 to 15 minutes a day, whenever you can find time around your routine, and then building that up over a year or two years before um, you really start to feel very confident using that language.